Good my afternoon. It's a little bit after one o'clock. It's 146 right now. I went out with dad, with dad this morning to uh, to go pick up a um, door for his house. Go get the door for his house. Um, still not ready to talk about what happened yesterday. I'll get to it. I just got some things. I don't want to say anything right now. Um, I'm sure some of you will be able to figure it out, but I just don't want to talk about it right now. But anyway, let's just get on with our day because it's depressing to think about it. So, uh, actually going to take this truck out for a ride because I haven't driven it since they fixed it. The old blue truck. 1989 Ford F-150 Lariat, but it has the 302 motor in it, so it's more fun to drive. And they got the transmission fixed in it, so we'll see how it runs. I haven't driven it since they got it fixed. I told Dad, I said, just give me the keys to it. I'm going to take it for a ride and see how it runs. So I'm going to do that because I haven't driven it in quite a while. That thing's rough. <laughs> I hit fourth gear and half the roof fell out on me. <laughs> the uh, the uh, foam piece is shedding. When I hit fourth gear, it just all flew out on me. That and like straw and stuff from the truck just flew up at me. But it runs rough. The transmission is not perfect at all. It was just the clutch that they fixed. The transmission just needs a new transmission. So very rough. So I'm gonna hang out with dad for the rest of the evening, go to church and then probably go home after that. So should be fun. Should be fun. took the big yellow beast for a ride pushed her pretty hard she's a good little car little yellow beast that's what that's her name she's a little yellow beast so i did that i've just been sitting around the house all day don't have anything to do at all so it's been fun i'm not really done a whole lot though I, I just, you know, no desire today to do much of anything. But, uh, I'm going to take Dad's see I brought Dad, a pet Dad picked me up earlier, so I don't actually have my car. So I've got to take one of his vehicles to church tonight. I also have to wear a pair of his jeans or something. So, yep. Gotta have something to wear. So we're gonna go find something of his that I can wear, supposedly. He's a little bit bigger than I am when it comes to pant sizes. He likes his loose, I like mine tight, so a big difference there. But that dune buggy has a problem. When you're coming uphill in first gear, where it lets off the to all the torque at once, it causes you to spin all the way up through here and I do this to the gravel. Yeah, I gotta figure that thing out. I've been trying to push the clutch in, but it sneaks off on you, like it'll sneak. But you you, th you only push the pedal in just about a quarter of an inch to get like full, full torque on first gear. Because it's so low, has it's such high gears, that you only get to like 10 mile per hour before you change from first to second. Or, or, low, or, or lower speed, it just depends. So when I'm, when I'm pushing the gas in, I don't push it in far to come up this hill because I don't want to spin the gravel, but it sneaks off and then I have to push it back in and it goes <laughs> spins, the spins the tires so I'm just still trying to figure that out but I'm good on the streets on the streets I can find that thing like nobody's business I've already figured it out so then we'll go in here eat a sandwich I think and then go to church pretty lazy day I suppose just kind of hanging around floating doing whatever I want, please, want to and please so it's nice it's nice the hills are alive with the sound of music. Oh, this is dizzy. Oh, okay. Hey guys, 
guys, it is dark, very dark. It is uh, almost 10 o'clock. I left church, went back up to dad's. Dad brought me to Irwin because I thought that's where Reed and Toby were going to be. But however, they had already left, so I had dad, dad to bring me home. I got my car. I'm heading to meet them out here. We're going to go watch a movie. We're going to go watch uh, Now You See Me. I don't know what it's about. I haven't seen the previews. I haven't seen anything about this movie. So uh, I'm going out on a limb and hoping it's a good movie because they want to see it and they invited me to go. So I'm going to go. So. I gotta take all this stuff off my mind that's been ha that's happened in the past day so well the past two days so just kind of kind of just got to get out and enjoy life I suppose I'll, I'll, I'm strong and I'll make it through this thing I'll, I'll tell you guys soon I promise I just don't want to I don't feel like expressing anything about it right now uh, because everything's not finalized and everything just kind of I'm just kind of moving along with it right now and I don't want to uh, say anything that I'm going to regret saying. That's, that's the only reason I haven't said anything is because I don't want to say anything that I'm not supposed to say or I, that I'm not that I'm supposed to that could hinder anything that in the future. I just want to kind of lay low for a few minutes for, for a couple days and just get, get on my feet and just, you know, all this stuff. I'll, I'll, I'll let you know about it later but I'm going to watch this movie and take my mind off of things because I've been worrying too much lately and my hair's falling out and turning gray so just need to calm down that's all I did I just need to relax and just be myself that's all it is just be fun old love loving Nathan who can be very outgoing who can also be reserved at the same time it's I am my own person. I'm a different person from everyone else, and I handle things a lot different than everyone else. I'm, a, I'm very private when it comes to my personal life sometimes, and sometimes I want to express everything. I am very bipolar when it comes to my actions. So, I. Be happy. Happy. Be happy now. Song. Hey guys, so I am home from the movies. We saw uh, Now You See Me. Really good movie. I had no idea what it was about before I went, but now I know. So, And it was really good. Um, like I said, it just took my mind off of everything. And, you know, progressing. That's all we, get, that's all we can do from this point. So, let's keep moving on and continue to grow. So, uh, Right now, I'm going to go ahead and get some sleep. It's a 10 after 1 in the morning, so I really need to get some sleep for tomorrow. I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow. Probably just hanging out and chilling around, so. But, yeah, just kind of moving along with the flow, I suppose. So, I will see you guys tomorrow. hope you guys had a good day. Good night, guys. Peace out.